So I get those exact the exact kind, and I actually had seen them online. Okay, number three was this uh, little redneck screen setup. Basically, bought what, about six feet of screen. I think it was a 72 by 36. Cut it in half. I tucked it on the outside. I'll show you that. But it works as a nice window screen. Keeps the bugs out. Keeps the cool. Lets the cool air in when there is a breeze. Uh, has some cheap duct tape on there now. I bought some Grella tape to hold it in better. Something that's got some stick but won't leave a permanent mark on the doors. But it's just good when you're parked. I don't want anything to set up anything permanent. I could set up some Velcro or something, but this was just a little quick setup and it does the job. And then when you're just out on the road, just take it down. But I'll show you, all I did was just tuck it in on the outside. It doesn't look, it does look kind of stealthy. So all I do is uh, leave a couple inches of overlap. And with two people, we just hold the screen in, close the door. So while it's parked, we just don't use these doors. When you're just getting on the road, you just take it down and fold it, it, fold it up. But just tucked it in, tucked it in along this edge, along the outer edge of the door. Just close it and then tape the bottom. Just a simple setup, keeps the bugs out. Doesn't look obvious unless you're like right next to it. And here we have our outdoor entertainment center. Yeah, we're picking up a we're picking up about 11 channels with a five dollar antenna. Here we have the Untouchables. Picking up a, there's our little five dollar antenna. Even when we set up higher, actually, it wasn't working any better. Right, here's our outdoor, outdoor entertainment center plugged in outdoors. You see the fancier RVs have their built-in entertainment center, so this is our little low-budget entertainment. The next thing I want to show you is our awning. I'm gonna I'm gonna take out the awning and show you that. Hey buddy! <laughs> 